Hey everyone, today I'll be showcasing how you can customize your favorites tab in the new Craft UI update. This will mainly apply to Steam users, and you're gonna want a world where it's only day and you have caves enabled. This won't apply to console players, but you can learn a few things as well that will help you out when organizing your favorites tab. So in the new crafting tab, what you can do, you can select an item and then favorite it. And then here in the favorites tab in the top left, that item will show up right in your favorites tab. Unfortunately, the items are going to be listed in the order you favorited them, and you really can or reorder them in game without unfavoriting all the items you've already favorited. So here we have the think tank. I want this think tank over here, and it seems I forgot a boat, and I would like that boat next to my think tank. What you're gonna have to do, you're gonna have to unfavorite this. Here we have the think tank in the front. Now every item after here, I have to unfavorite, go to the seafaring tab, and then re-favorite all the items in the order that I like them. And there we go, that, that's the order I would have preferred that it was in. Now, if you have a very large favorites tab, trying to reorganize it all is going to be very, very annoying. Fortunately, there is a way to reorganize them all via editing a file. What you're going to want to do is open a file called Crafting Menu Profile found in your Client Save folder with your text editor of choice. I prefer Notepad++. File's location is in Documents, Play, Don't Starve Together, a folder listing your Steam ID, then Client Save, and then Crafting Menu Profile. And what you're going to see here in this favorite section is the items that you favorited listed by their prefab name. So axe is axe, pickaxe is pickaxe, shovel, etc. So what you're going to want to do if you want to reorganize something is simply move the location of the listed prefab name. So here we have Research Lab 3 and Research Lab 4. Research Lab 3 is actually the Shadow Manipulator. Research Lab 4 is the Presta Hanitator. I want the Presta Hanitator before my Shadow Manipulator. So all you do, you highlight Research Lab 4 in the, with the quotation marks and the comma if there's a comma. You cut it, I use Control X. Here we have Research Lab 3, you paste it, Control V, and there we go. Research Lab 4 in the quotation marks with the comma, and then Research Lab 3. So what you do, you go back in game. I did not shut my game off by the way. And here we have, it hasn't been updated in the game yet. So this is why you need a caves world. Just go down to caves. You check your favorites tab again. And there you go, it's been updated. So every time you update something, after you favorite them and reorganize them in the, in the file, you can, you can just go back and up and down the cave to make sure it's in the order you want them. It'll dra drastically speed up how quickly you can reorganize your favorites tab. And here's the end result of my favorites tab. I like to rush all the bosses of the game. So I've organized my favorites tab to help me remember what items I need to make in order to make that possible. You can, of course, organize your favorites tabs to your liking. And this favorite tabs is global, meaning that this tab will be the same no matter what world you're playing in. Guarantee that you're on the same PC. I don't know about the Steam, how the Steam Cloud works. It might work with the Steam Cloud. I'm not entirely sure. Do keep in mind that the very last item listed in the favorite section does not have a comma to it. If you add a comma to it, your favorites tab will end up looking blank. In the event your favorites tab ever does end up looking blank, it means somewhere along the line you've made a mistake. So do just keep that in mind. And that's all I've got to say. Thanks for watching, have a nice one.